Oh, hey, it's me on my iPad again. I'm doing something just slightly sketchy. Um, I'm actually driving while I'm talking to you. And the reason that I'm talking to you now is I wanted to tell you a little bit about my writer's group. A writer's group is a very small select group of, in my case, women writers. It doesn't have to be all women. Uh, we meet every couple weeks. We exchange um, whatever work in progress we've got with us and then we read and talk about it. And it is the most vital, dynamic day of my week is when I get together with my girls and we go over whatever is being worked on. We brainstorm, we laugh, we argue, we fight, we critique, we praise each other. We're just like everything. So um, I'm driving to a little town called Silverdale. There's a really cute, place called Old Town, a little section down on the on the waterfront, and we meet at a bakery there. And the reason we meet at the bakery is, number one, they got a great um, meeting room, but number two, it's the one incentive that gets us out of bed and into our cars and getting together is the promise of a wonderful, yummy, hot pastry and a cup of coffee. When I first sold a book in 1986, I knew that I needed to improve my craft and the first thing that I did was I joined a writer's group. And I can't, I, I can't tell you how transformative that is for a writer. It's just amazing. So anyway, um, here I am all these years later. I'm still a member of a writer's group. This particular group, the core of us have been together oh gosh, 15 years? I, I don't even count anymore. We celebrate birthdays, marriages, divorces, kids' triumphs, kids' tragedies, pretty much everything. And we have a great time doing it. So it's friendship, it's fellowship, it's collegial, it's pretty much everything. And I can't say enough about my girls. I'm just, I, I'm so smitten with them in every way and so hopefully as these little um, these little videos go on maybe you'll learn some more about them because it's really a big part of my life as a writer